And next speaker is Mr. Mats Mura. And he's coming for, actually, he has been trained in the Maeda, Maeda lab. So <laughs> he's, of course, the one who will, will be talking about the EBR effect. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. So uh, let me start the background. Uh, actually, we are not able to distinguish uh, normal human cells from the cancerous uh, human cell. Uh, therefore, we need to develop drug delivery system uh, whereby uh, toxic, toxic anti-cancer agent can be selectively delivered to the uh, cancer, t cancer cells. Uh, the first paper of the EPR effect, enhanced permeability and retention effect, uh, was published in 1986 by me and uh, Professor Maeda. And since then, uh, various uh, anti-cancer agent formulation and uh, gene delivery systems have been produced. Uh, and uh, and uh, the, the first paper uh, has been cited more than 4,700. So uh, the, 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 the EPR effect uh, has been uh, widely uh, verified uh, in the animal experiments. However, it has not been used widely in clinics. Uh, above all, uh, the therapy using DDS is not a mainstream uh, technique in the field of oncology. Uh, uh, MCC465 uh, is a DDS produced by, by the, the Mitsubishi Pharma uh, Corporation, Japan, more than 20 years ago. The formulation consists of uh, doxorubicin incorporated a liposome uh, conjugate, conjugated with PEG and the anti-GH molecular antibody that uh, speci specifically uh, bind to the stomach cancer cells. The MCC465 was highly anticipated because uh, the formulation, uh, formulation uh, 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 utilized both the EPR effect and the active targeting mechanism uh, resulting from the, the, this antibody. In fact, the ex animal experiment revealed uh, a remarkable anti-tumor activity in two kinds of uh, human uh, stomach cancer uh, genografts. Unexpectedly, however, uh, uh, no anti-tumor response was observed in the clinical trials. This data this, uh, has prompted, prompted me uh, seriously to uh, consider why MCC465 uh, is not in, in effective in humans, despite the, the, the uh, remarkable anti activity in mice. Also, why the DDS is not, not mainstream uh, uh, treatment uh, modality in clinics. To answer this question, we compare the clinical pancreatic cancer tissue with the pancreatic tumor xenografts. And, and, we, and then we found a, a clear difference between the two. Uh, specifically, in the clinical pancreatic cancer has uh, uh, possess, uh, possessed uh, uh, strom, uh, uh, abundant stroma. The, the, because the tumor vessels are present in tumor stroma, it is reasonable to hypothesize that the the the, the tum uh, stroma bar tumor stroma may be a barrier uh, hindering the distribution of the macromolecules within the tumor tissues. In contrast, pancreatic tumor genograph contain only tumor cells and uh, no uh, tumor stroma at all. So we, from these re results, we concluded that DDS is effective in. in 
in, in the uh, tumor, uh, in mice tumors, because of the lack of tumor stroma. On the other hand, DDS is ineffective in uh, clinical pancreatic cancer because uh, stroma barrier may uh, prevent DDS from, uh, from reaching cancer cells. Uh, now, uh, and then we uh, consider why and how the, the tumor stroma is formed. Uh, if uh, to, uh, cancer cluster erodes adjacent normal or tumor vessels, hemorrhage may occur, and uh, the fibrin clot form, fibrin clots should immediately form in situ to stop the bleeding. And then these fibrin clots are subsequently replaced by the collagen, as occurs in a normal wound healing process. Although there are many uh, similarities between normal wound healing process and, uh, and uh, the, the mechanisms underlying the tumor induced stroma, the fundamental di difference between the two is that uh, the, 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 the pathophysiological condition uh, in cancer lasts for as long as cancer cells survive in the body. Uh, therefore, uh, it, uh, it is assumed that uh, the, this malignant cycle of blood coagulation uh, may uh, generate versatile tumor stromas. In, once uh, uh, blood coagulation occurs in, in t uh, tumor tissues, insoluble fibrin uh, is uh, produced from the fib fibrinogen and this insoluble fibrin uh, is then uh, immediately degraded by the plasmin, uh, uh, plasmin in the uh, in, uh, in the, tu uh, in the tu tumor tissue, and then uh, uh, this uh, fibrin degradation product FDP uh, is uh, then uh, uh, dissolved in the bloodstream. So uh, insoluble fibrin. Uh, exists only in the pathological condition, including cancer. Then we uh, thought to uh, uh, create uh, uh, a monoclonal antibody against insoluble furin. After, uh, after long uh, de uh, developmental per period, uh, we successfully developed the monoclonal antibody uh, that only uh, bind to the insoluble furin, but uh, not soluble fibrin again, and uh, soluble fibrin and uh, soluble FDP. We also demonstrated that uh, the, the monoclonal antibody recognized the epitope, uh, uh, epitope uh, 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 in the, uh, the, the specific uh, special hole that uh, uncovered only uh, when fibrin clots form. The, 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 the epitope is uh, epitope by the, this monoclonal antibody uh, is a hydrophobic region on the on the beta chain, and then the, the, this, that uh, interacts closely with the counterpart region on the gamma chain in the soluble state. Uh, using this antibody, uh, as you see, uh, the various kind of tumor possessed uh, fibrin clots. On the other hand, normal tissue are uh, all negative. It should be stressed that uh, uh, there is no clear de fibrin deposition in the chronic or uh, late phase of cerebral infarction, cardiac infarction, and pancreatitis. Because this molecular antibody uh, uh, cross react with uh, uh, the mouse in soluble fibrin, uh, we then uh, developed uh, the PET probe using this monoclonal antibody. The radio level monoclonal antibody was injected in mice uh, bearing uh, uh, the chemically induced spontaneous tumor uh, possessing the amount of fib fibrin clots. And you see, uh, the show, this showed a clear and specific accumulation in tumor tissues. We then created uh, uh, ant uh, antibody drug conjugate using uh, this uh, anti-insoluble fibrin antibody uh, 
and uh, which conjugated uh, conjugated with the uh, anti-cancer agent by uh, uh, barring lysine, lysine uh, linkers that can be cut by the plasmin uh, on, on produced only in uh, fibrin clots. The the ADC may uh, extravasate from legitima vessels and bind to the uh, specific holes uh, in the fibrin clots. And then uh, create a scaffold from which efficient clearance, or efficient uh, release of uh, un free uh, anti-cancer agent may occur. And uh, this uh, anti-cancer agent is only released uh, when uh, the the, the, a the when the ADC is bound to the, the these specific holes. Uh, in the fibrin clots, because the the plasmin is only active, uh, active only in the fibrin clots, and the plasmin is neutralized by the uh, the, the alpha to anti plasmin circulating in the blood. So uh, the released anti cancer agent may can easily uh, reach to, to the cancer cell uh, using uh, the diffusion uh, through uh, tumor stroma. Also, another benefit of this ADC is that the uh, released anti cancer agent may also attack the tumor vascular uh, endothelial cells. Uh, this is the last slide. And, uh, uh, we compare the pancreatic cancer, human clinical pancreatic cancer, and, and the spontaneous pancreat, uh, pancreat tumor uh, from the t trans transgenic KPG, KPG mouse. So uh, as you see, both tumor do cancer uh, possess a amount of uh, fibrin clots. So, and then uh, and our ADC only improved the survival in this KPC mouse after the treatment. So the, the, the cancer strong targeting therapy, uh, cast therapy based on the EPR effect will be a highly effective new strategy for treating uh, invasive tumors in humans. Thank you for attention. Wonderful, wonderful talk. Thank you. So the conceptually, uh, the formation of tumor stroma in the pancreatic cancer versus, let's say, the breast cancer, do you think everything will be the similar steps? Because one of your ideas suggesting that, you know, the pancreatic cancer, you know, the way you, you model actually, I don't know whether that is really valid for the tumor stroma formation in pancreatic cancer because very, it is already known that, you know, initial angiogenesis is kicking point and there the anti-angiogenic things is secreted by the cancer cells. That is destabilized angiogenesis followed by the early dissemination of cancer cells. So I, I don't know that the model you created is really reflecting to the pancreatic cancer stromal formations. Maybe it's good for breast cancer or other cancer, but I don't know the pancreatic cancer. Uh, actually, uh, the the, the invasive cancer generally possess this kind of uh, tumor stroma uh, because uh, the, 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 they, uh, the, if the malignant gray, uh, uh, bad uh, uh, malignant, also, also the, there is a, uh, uh, many very, various kinds of malignancy and uh, if uh, you have the low, uh, high malignant tumors. This has a, a very invasive. Also, these cancer possess a <coughs> tissue factor that, that is a trigger protein or the extrinsic blood coagulation. So that uh, the, the uh, higher malignant tumor cause uh, uh, this higher amount of co blood coagulation. And then finally, you can see the fibrin deposition in the tumor. So that uh, usually human tumors uh, have a lot of uh, fibrin clots in the tumors. Thank you very much. Okay. I think we can ask the other questions afterwards. If you don't mind. Very good question. Maybe I sure. can. Well, no.
Hang on. Sorry, because it's recorded. So a wonderful talk, and actually the KPC model has been hardly used in nanomedicine field, so that's uh, remarkable. Um, in KPC model, did you check for the EPR effect with imaging, um, with the like uh, imaging studies compared to the subcutaneous model? No, I didn't, but uh, yes, this is uh, based on the EPR effect, and then, uh, of course, because First EPR effect, then we need the, uh, the, the, the penetration effect within the tumor tissue. So, so uh, but uh, I didn't uh, check. Thank you very much again. Thank you. So the next